This is Tony Schiavone coming at you in the AEW Control Center. Hi, everybody. Dynasty Week is here. The big week, which culminates this Sunday with our AEW Dynasty pay-per-view, begins tonight with two hours of AEW Dynamite Live on TBS. Tonight's telecast takes the air at 8, 7 Central and originates from Indianapolis and the Indiana Farmers Coliseum. Tickets for Indianapolis tonight available at AEWTIX.com. And what a lead in this is for Sunday's big event. Tonight in a mixed tag match, the team of TNT champion Adam Copeland and Willow Nightingale will face Brody King and TBS champion Julia Hart of the House of Black. Last Wednesday at the end of Copeland's successful title defense on Dynamite, the lights went out and all hell broke loose in the ring. Just under 10 minutes remaining as Copeland turns things around. Goes in and the spear! Oh, money! Uh oh, two, three! Wow! Wow! The winner of this match, and TNT champion, the Rated R Superstar, Adam Copeland! What a match these two men had, both of them, tremendous. Give a lot of credit to Penta on that. He pushed Copeland as no one has yet. Yeah, Penta El Cerro Miedo made the Rated R Superstar earn every bit of his second defense of that TNT uh, Championship. It's just, it, it was mostly Penta throughout this battle, as we know. But then that last second right there, Penta made a little error. He tried to do something, springboard off those ropes, and Cope saw it, boom, spear, and that was it. Yeah, great anticipation, great improvisation by the Rated R Superstar Adam Copeland. I mean, he, he is a phenomenal TNT champion. And whoa, whoa. Well, now the lights have gone out here in Charleston. Well, you know what? We know what's coming up at, yeah, uh, at Dynasty. Julia Hart, the TBS champion, oh, but Brody oh, King God. behind Copeland. House of Black. Big man right there, Big Brody. This is after the battle that Cope just went through. And Brody King now. Oh, oh just God. running boot into the jaw of Copeland. And Tony, that's right, it'll be House of Black versus Copeland. Mark Briscoe and Eddie Kingston in 11 days time at Dynasty. As oh, he's got that rear naked choke on him. Oh, but Julia Hart, what is she? Well, Wait Willow Nightingale. Willow Nightingale. She earned her shot at oh. Julia Hart and the TBS Championship last week. And look at this, Brody King pulling Julia Hart out of harm's way. And oh, uh -oh. easy, easy, yeah, Brody, guys. Look, she got, she got that, I think, that mist all over her face. Julia had the the mist loaded up. And now Brody King. Oh, the low bridge. He goes over the top rope to the floor. And I think this save by Willow Nightingale may have been the last thing oh, yeah. that Adam Copeland expected, but a timely save nonetheless. There you see at the bottom of your screen, Copeland, Briscoe, and Kingston versus the House of Black at Dynasty. Plus, Willow Nightingale will challenge Julia Hart for the TBS Championship on April 21st. Willow Nightingale, who has that TBS title shot coming up this Sunday, comes out to the aid of Copeland. And that spawned these comments later in the program. Mark Briscoe, congratulations on winning the Ring of Honor world title this past weekend at Supercard. Uh, you guys really put each other through it. So physically, how do you guys feel? I mean, we're just over a week away from Dynasty where you guys are gonna be in a six-man tag team match. Well, Renee, I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm feeling amazing. <laughs> hey, but simultaneously, I'm in pain, I can't lie to you. We had a dog fight, a war. King, how you feeling, dog? Uh, I feel confused right now. I don't know what simultaneously means, but uh, I'm beat up dog too, but you know what? It's pro wrestling, it ain't ballet, folks. So we do what we gotta do. Hey, guys. Okay, I love you guys, you know that. I saw that dog fight you guys had, Ring of Honor. You good? Okay. I'm as good as I can be right now. I don't know if you saw Brody. Julia Hart, they tried to jump on me, so I just want to make sure we are good. We are good for Dynasty. Okay. I have a great idea. 
actually for head of Dynasty, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What about this? Next week on Dynamite, you put that TNT championship on the line against Willow Nightingale. No, no, she no, gonna no, whoop no. your ass, man. That's, that's not what we were saying, Stokely. No, no. Brody, I saw you beating up on Adam. Julia, try to get me. Not enough damage this time. My eyes are good. So, Dynamite next week? What do you say we team up? I got an idea. Before Dynasty, before the three of us, the, the rated chicken hawks. I don't know, I just made that, I just made that up. Before we take out the House of Black, Willow, what do you say? You and me, Brody King, Julie Hart, next week on Dynamite. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's do it, kid. Yes. <sighs> hey, real quick, last time I saw you, I said you smelled like Burger King and Newports. I apologize. I just should not have said that publicly. We good? For the first time ever, the TNT champion will be in the ring at the same time as the TBS champion. TNT champ Adam Copeland and Willow Nightingale will face off against TBS champ Julia Hart and Brody King of the House of Black in a mixed tag team match. Also tonight, in a trios match, the elite, Matthew and Nicholas Jackson, the Young Bucks, and AEW Continental Champion Kazuchika Okada will meet the trio of Pac, Daniel Garcia, and Penta El Sierro Miedo. Last Wednesday, at the end of the Okada match on Dynamite, Pac and the Young Bucks all got involved in a melee. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Watch there. out. Rainmaker! The torque he gets on it's amazing. Two and three. Dads, he just spins him around and rears back. Winner. You can see it, man. The Rainmaker, Kazuchika Okada! And when he does with it, he steps through. As he steps through, he brings his hip his hip thrust through the, the clothesline. I mean, which brings so much more impact when you hit someone like that. Now, Okada now oh has a microphone. Are we going to hear from the Continental Champion? It seems so. Hey, Pac. I accept your challenge. I will see you at Dynasty. Okada not mincing words, accepting the challenge of the bastard pack. Uh oh, uh oh. And there he is. Doesn't take much to rile up pack, I can tell you that. Nah, he's always fired up. And could we be looking at the next AEW Continental Champion? This could be a very short reign for the Rainmaker Taz. Hey, you're Here dealing with that cat right there, Pac, who's now heading to the ring. Look at this. That's a bad apple right there. And Okada, he's not backing down. But, oh. Watch out from behind. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Matthew and Nicholas Jackson from behind. Watching the back now, of Okada. Three on one by the elite. This is... Completely unnecessary attack. The super kicks on Pack. EVPs Matthew and Nicholas Jackson this is too easy. with the hands of Okada dropping Pack and Okada could be thinking punctuation mark. Yeah, here it comes. Got to be careful here. It's and coming. Oh, wait, what the? Oh, FTR. Oh boy, FTR having the back of Pack or maybe. More precisely, their sights set on Matthew and Nicholas Jackson, the Young Bucks. And Nicholas sent packing Matthew, getting battered. And oh. now FTR lining them up. Oh, we can see this coming. Oh, my it's God. Okada, no! Oh, no! Okada with a chair. Oh! It's a cash and a shot across the spine for Dax as well. And now the elite with the difference maker. Kazuchika Okada with a steel chair in his oh, hand. Brother. What a shot right there. Man, that was on target, and so was that one. FTR getting nailed. They're not done. The ball. Oh. oh, my God. Dax Harwood got absolutely blasted by that last one. Oh, no. And oh, now... No. The EVP trigger for FTR. And look at this pack stumbling oh, up no. to his feet. Oh, and boy. Okada! Oh, no! Oh, God, he got in the side of the head. 
Okada swinging that chair, cracking it on the skull of the bastard pack. Well, as Dynasty gets closer and closer, things are heating up here in AEW. And in this past Saturday, live on Collision, we heard this from the Bastard Pack. Kazuchika Okada. Believe it or not, Bonnie lad, I would like to thank you. Not only for accepting my challenge, but also for walloping me around the head with a big dirty lump of steel. That was very brave of you, wasn't it, huh? And now, as a result, I have a perpetual headache that serves as motivation to remind everybody exactly who I am. Now, I may not be tall and handsome. I am not a Japanese superstar. I do not own a Ferrari, and I am certainly not flavor of the month. Okada, you may think you're God's gift to professional wrestling, but you're not. You crap, and what I am is better than you. And next Sunday, at AW Dynasty, live from St. Louis, Missouri, I am going to relish the opportunity to prove it in front of the entire world. You understand me, hmm? Good. As Pac and Okada are set to do battle Sunday for the Continental Championship, Neither man can overlook the trios match coming up tonight. The same can be said for the Young Bucks. Also last Wednesday, the team of Chris Jericho, Hook, and Shibata faced Shane Taylor Promotions in a trios match. Jericho and Hook got into an argument. Things broke down between the two, and Shibata ended up getting pinned. Moriarty with the upper hand on Katsuyori Shibata. Moriarty. Oh, oh. Nice back heel trip right there. A little version of an old Soto Gallery for those judo enthusiasts. Easy, Easy for you to say. <laughs> exactly. And Jericho, he's on he's on his feet on the floor, but I think, oh, what the? Oh, Jericho. What the hell? I told you she'd be listening to Hey, don't worry about this. Worry about this. Don't tell you listen to me. I told you about the learning tree. I know you got to What the hell is Look at Jericho. Trying to sort things out. Moriarty and Shibata continue. And now Shibata, uh -oh. the sleeper, is locked in. And the argument still goes on. Jericho had said, listen to me on the floor. But this, uh, Shibata's got to be careful here. That oh, Shane oh Taylor. God. Oh, my God. Just an unimpeded right hand on Katsuyori Shibata. The fang by Moriarty. Moriarty, is he going to take this? Two, three. Oh, man. There are your winners. Shane. Wow, the, the argument between Hook and Chris Jericho left the door open for Shane Taylor to land that big right hand and put Shibata essentially out and just set him up for Lee Moriarty. And with that fan, that was the biggest win of Lee Moriarty's career, no doubt. I mean, a huge win. Tempers, uh, you know, you got to be careful, Hook. He's got to temper. It takes a while to get them. Jericho pissed them off, and this this thing backfired here. Yeah, Tempers flaring. This new incarnation of Shane Taylor promotions victorious, but Hook and Chris Jericho obviously not on the same page. Good respect being shown by Hook to Katsuyori Shibata. So after the match, Jericho wanted to talk with Hook's father, Taz. And here's what happened, as we saw on Collision. Come on, I gotta talk to Taz. Taz, Taz, listen. I, I wanted to catch you before you left the building. Uh, you saw what happened tonight, right? Yeah. And I, I, want, I want to explain myself to Hook and let him know I'm trying to, to do what's right for him, but he won't answer his phone, he won't answer his text. No. You know him better than anybody else. Can you do me a favor and please ask him if, if he'll talk to me? I can try. Um, a lot of times, 
I don't hear from him. Like, he's his own man. He yeah, does his own thing. I know, I know. He's unpredictable, yeah. and I do think you pissed him off. Okay. And, okay. and when he gets pissed, it's a little... So I could try. He's unpredictable, but I should try. Okay, do me a favor and at least try. Okay? I will try. I really want to talk to him. You got it. I'll okay. try. Okay. Thanks, man. Tonight, Taz will broker a meeting between Chris Jericho and Hook to try to get this fine team back on track. Also tonight, in singles action, in what should be nothing less than a barn burner, Claudio Castagnoli of the BCC will square off with the aerial assassin, Will Ospreay. And in women's action, Deanna Perrazzo goes up against Mariah May. As we announced Saturday on Collision, John Moxley last Friday in Chicago at the New Japan Pro Wrestling Windy City Riot event wins the IWGP World Heavyweight title by dethroning Tetsuya Naido. Tonight, Moxley returns to Dynamite Live as the IWGP World Heavyweight Champion. Plus, heading to this Sunday's Dynasty pay-per-view event, we will hear from both World Champion Samoa Joe and challenger Swerve Strickland. And tonight, we will hear from the CEO, Mercedes Monet. These events and many others tonight on AEW Dynamite Live as the road to Dynasty kicks off will originate from Indianapolis at the Indiana Farmers Coliseum. Airtime tonight on TBS is 8, 7 central with tickets available at AEWTIX.com. Big reminder fans, this Saturday join us for a live collision rampage doubleheader on TNT. Will originate from the Peoria Civic Center in Peoria, Illinois. That's right, on the eve of Dynasty, we'll have three hours of AEW action, collision followed by rampage. We'll all be live on TNT and tickets in Peoria available at AEWTIX.com. We're now only four days out from AEW Dynasty, the next AEW pay-per-view spectacular. It is set for this Sunday, April 21st, from the Shavitz Arena in St. Louis. Here's the card. For the AEW World title, Samoa Joe defends against Swerve Strickland. A one-on-one -on -one dream match, the aerial assassin, Will Ospreay, meets the American Dragon, Brian Danielson. The championship match of the AEW World Tag Team Title Tournament has now become a ladder match for that vacated title. As the Young Bucks will meet FTR, the winner of this match becomes the first ever three-time AEW World Tag Team Champ. Julia Hart defends TBS Championship against Willow Nightingale. In trios action, the team of Adam Copeland, the TNT Champ, plus Eddie Kingston and ROH World Champion Mark Briscoe meet the House of Black. For the AEW Continental Championship, Kazuchika Okada defends against the Bastard Pack. And just announced on Saturday for the AEW International title, two former friends square off as Roderick Strong defends against Kyle O'Reilly. Tickets for Dynasty at the Shavitz Arena available at AEWTIX.com. Now for everyone else around the world, the only way to watch the upcoming Dynasty pay-per-view event is by ordering on Bleacher Report cable or satellite providers, Triller.tv, PBV.com, and on YouTube. Also, AEW pay-per-views are now available nationwide at David Buster's. AEW fans can now watch all AEW pay-per-views at your local David Buster's. Visit DaveAndBusters.com to find your closest location and confirm availability. Internationally, fans can watch Dynasty on Triller.tv, PBV.com, and on YouTube in select territories. And fans in Australia can now watch AEW Dynasty and all AEW pay-per-views on main event, available on Foxtel and KO Sports. Okay, fans, some very important events to announce, so make note of these. Three new events to talk about and when you can get tickets. Colorado AEW fans, come see the Loveland, Colorado debut of AEW Dynamite Wednesday, June 5th at the Blue Arena. That's right, we're coming back to the Denver, Colorado area in Loveland, Colorado. AEW Collision is headed to the PPL Center in Allentown, Pennsylvania, Thursday, June 20th. That's right on the Thursday. It's double the action in Buffalo, New York as AEW Dynamite and Collision head to the Key Bank Center, Wednesday, June 26th. Tickets for all three events, Loveland, Colorado, Allentown, and Buffalo become first available tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. local at AEWTIX.com. Now, pre-sales for those three cities began yesterday. You might be wondering, how can I get in on the pre-sale action? Well, that's by becoming an AEW Insider. Go to AEWTIX.com. At the top of the page, click on Insider Sign Up. You'll be signing up to gain access to Insider News, 
special ticket and merchandise deals and exclusive pre-sale on-sale opportunities not available to the general public. That's AEW Insider at AEWTIX.com. All in London at Wembley Stadium is rapidly approaching Sunday, August 25th. Don't miss your chance to be a part of it. For tickets and information, go to ticketmaster.co.uk or livenation.co.uk. But tonight, we begin Dynasty Week as we kick off things with two hours of AEW Dynamite, live from Indianapolis and the Indiana Farmers Coliseum. Airtime tonight on TBS is 8, 7 central with tickets available at AEWTIX.com. Come early. Matches begin in the Indiana Farmers Coliseum at 7.30 tonight. This is Tony Schiavone from the AEW Control Center. See you tonight in Indianapolis and through the lens of TBS. We are AEW, where the best wrestle.